Hey guys, here's a quick video showing how you can root your Samsung Galaxy S2 phone. Uh, as you'll see, it's a very simple procedure. It takes about 10 minutes or so, and it's very straightforward. Uh, so I found this on the XDA Developers Forum. Uh, the thread name is Xperia X10 Easy Rooting Toolkit Zergrush Exploit. Uh, as you see here, it does say Xperia X10. However, it does work for a few other phones, as you can see here and you do have the Samsung Galaxy S2 here, so it's gonna work without any problems. Um, so the one thing that you need to note is that you're gonna need to register to these forums because there's one file that you need to download from here and you do need to be a member to be able to download it and that's this file, the Doomlord v1 root zerg rush busy box su.zip. So I already do have it on my computer so I'm not gonna go ahead and download it again but that's the first thing that you're gonna want to download. Another file that you're gonna want to download is the Samsung Keys. Uh, so you can just do a Google search for it. Uh, it's gonna actually be the second link here. And once you're on a Samsung page, you just click on Download Keys for Windows. Uh, I do have it on my computer here. I did install it, so I'm not gonna do it once again. What that does basically is it's gonna install some drivers on your computer that's going to allow you to do the uh, routing. So once that's done, there's a few things that you need to do on your phone first. Uh, the first thing is you need to enable USB debugging. Uh, you're going to be able to find that in Menu, Settings, Applications, Development. So you just uh, check that box here. And the second thing you need to enable is Unknown Sources. That's going to be under Menu, Settings, Applications. So once you've done that, you can grab your USB cable, connect your phone to your computer, and we're going to be good to go. What we're going to need to do at this point is open the folder where you've downloaded the zip file from the forums, and you we're going to need to extract that. So I'm going to go ahead and do it. I'm using 7-zip, so I'll just do extract here. And at this point, what you need to do, double click on Run Me. You confirm all the above, press any keys, and there it goes. It started. Uh, now that's going to take about, um, I don't know, it took me about six minutes the first time I did it. Uh, so it's not that long, but at this point you don't need to do anything else. You just wait for it to reboot your phone, uh, and once that's done, your phone will be rooted. So here's what it's going to look like once it's done. Uh, so as you can see here, it's going to reboot your device. Uh, actually, it took less time than I expected. It's about four minutes or so. Uh, but yeah, that's it. You're done. Your phone has been rooted. Uh, in the future, I'll post a few videos as to what you can do once your phone has been rooted. Uh, if you have any questions, feel free to ask me in the comments. And uh, thanks for watching.